Thomas the Tank Engine doo -doo. <coughs> Thomas arrived at Wellsworth Station. Right on time, said Sir Thomas Hunt. Very well, said Thomas. Ooh, splendid indeed, said the coaches. <coughs> but the engines were cross at Tidmouth Chance. Where's Percy? said Gordon. We get no rice, complained James. He sat on a turntable and noticed Henry looking glum. Stop arguing, Henry, he said, and join the circus. Oh, said Percy, so you heard the news. What news? About the circus. Percy, what do you talk about? Henry didn't look happy. The circus is coming. I'm arranged to take it with me, and you guys are to help me. <laughs> the engines were able to help. Lots of things were being delivered. Gordon and James, however, were crossed because James had to take, take the circus train home. A little while later, Sir Thomas had arrived. Come along, Henry. The tunnel is blocked and I need your help. Henry had to do it. <laughs> pushing cars, pushing cars, huffed Henry. He appeared beside Henry's tunnel. The workman went in. Suddenly, <laughs> Help! they cried, and they ran out. We started to dig, but there was something in there. Rubbish, complained the foreman. It's not rubbish, it's big and alive. We're not going in there again. Right then, Henry, you'll have to go in. Henry gulped. Beep, beep. I don't want to go in there. Serves me, said the driver, but you have to do it. Henry pushed in, in with the cars. Suddenly, a big bump was heard, and out came the cars, and then a very large cross elephant. <gasps> well, I never, complained the foreman. They had to feed it lots of water, butter, and apples. Henry let off steam. <sighs> cried the elephant. Water hushed down all over Henry. Poor Henry. At last, the elephant keeper arrived to help the elephant home. But Henry was most annoyed. An elephant pushed me. An elephant hushed me, he cried. The troublesome trucks couldn't help but laugh and laugh. <laughs> that night at Tin Machine, the engines were all talking about it. First the rain, then an elephant, said Gordon. Whatever will you be afraid of next? Never mind, said Thomas. He was most grateful for Henry. You must be very brave. Henry couldn't help but smile. He knew Thomas's words were true, but he was a little afraid of the elephant. <laughs> from then on, Henry kept a sharp distance from elephants and was wise enough ne never to bump into one again. Thomas the Tank Engine. Mm-hmm. <laughs>